Oh uh, my goodness. What? What? Like, what? what? I didn't see this. What well, hallway is this? Okay. We're gonna go for load. 19%. I didn't even get to 20. Okay. So. Shit, 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 shit! So, um, <laughs> I was in the kitchen and I already saw this part, but more than likely, uh, I want to see what happens when I just keep going. Wait, am I supposed to come back? Wait, <laughs> I don't get it. What happened? this thing out. Let's go. <laughs> Shit. What happened? <laughs> I, I, I don't... It, okay, it's being really weird. I, I swear the last time... I was over here, the... Oh shit, I wasn't paying attention to the flash, I was looking at that. So it took longer. It took longer when you go over here. Damn. Uh, my head. Uh, it hurts. Yeah. I don't understand. My goodness, dude, you are already possessed, like I already said in the beginning. How are you getting these crayons? Son of a... Uh, nutcracker... know what this does just it's on a clock why am I walking like that <laughs> oh, fuck Darn dogs, I can hear them through my headset. And they must be, uh, it's not my dogs, I don't have any dogs. I used to. Long story though, don't want to explain it. Uh, but I will say I, I miss my babies. I don't like the way that looked at me. Oh shit.
What are you doing? Look up! Look up as you... Come on! What are you... Oh my goodness, okay. What's up with all these numbers? Gosh! Fuck. This is huge. I've never been here before. Isn't this- I thought you said this was your grandpa's house. What is that noise? I would have went exploring. Cuckoo? No cuckoo. It's really dusty. Uh, as if it took a picture. There's a hole! Why is there holes? I see a hole. What am I? Gio Giovina Maxwell, fifty six years old. In the shape of this portrait. I'm carrying too much already. Was that noise? I swear I just heard someone talking. But it's not outside, it's not in this room, it's not in the house, it was in here. Anyways, he's saying I'm carrying too much already, so... I wanna see... Let's take away... The... I'm closing this. We're gonna go to the safe. You close it. Actually, I think I'm gonna close that door just because I don't like it open. Actually, I'm gonna leave it open because it is it, it's it, it's light. <laughs> Let's close this. So you saying I'm carrying too much stuff. So what do I get rid of? Uh, let's store something. I broke the shovel. I think I don't think I need it anymore. Extra pockets, okay. This, I don't think I need it anymore. Um, I think I need this. Mm. You, you never know. I apologize for the little dogs. They're across the street. They always bark at a uh, pretty much nothing. Oh, oh, come, come on! I need to push triangle. Okay, we're gonna discard this, discard this, discard this, discard it. You don't really need to look at the door, right? Oh, I guess we do. some reason we need to keep the door picture No, I need that. You see what I mean? He's pointing, but where is he pointing at? 
Unless it's like this. Or what is it? Uh, I don't know, like this. I don't know. I don't know. Okay. Uh, come on. That's why I need a, a deep breath. It's telling me to grab it, uh, so I grab. I don't really know what I'm seeing. So it's a wall, it's a brick wall. What does it say? Three. Forty-three, I guess. Okay, so that thing just lit up. I didn't see that. Did you guys see that? Let me see that. It's like something... I can't... Too bad you can't bring it closer. <laughs> uh, anyway, grab it, I don't know. Maybe it's the wrong picture. Five years old, Albert Maxwell. Okay. Wait. There's like nothing back. Oh yeah, that was. Ugh. Age is just a number. You can add or subtract, but at the end of the day, when it com when time comes, you die anyways. Whoa, 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 whoa. Age is just a number. You can add or subtract, but at the end of the day, when the time comes, you die anyways. Okay. Wow. Add, subtract. So what are you adding? Okay. This is square over here. Okay, maybe that goes right there. I don't know. What's this? Key. Triangle. I don't know. What does the key do? I don't know what the key does. Ah, oh, maybe that's what I'm supposed to do. Is it the hammer, maybe? No? I don't know. Forty-three. Something's gonna be behind me, maybe. I don't know. I won't look. I'll just walk backwards. Okay. 
Okay, why is it quiet? What's up with this thing? Twenty-five. Wait. Fifty-six. The other one was five. So... I was about to take a picture right here. Nothing. <clears throat> Forty-three. Maybe I should have gotten the hammer, or left the, uh, you know, keep the hammer. I think something's gonna be down here. <clears throat> the 43 yeah. was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw a woman was killed by a police killed a police officer. The 43 by a police officer. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw a woman was killed by a police killed a police officer. The 43 by a police officer. The 43 was killed by a three-year-old woman. We saw a woman was killed by a police killed a police. 43-year-old. That's what it showed on the wall. What do I do with the pictures? Oh! <laughs> um, let's go back, go get the hammer. Maybe. Maybe I'm supposed to have the hammer. Oh. <clears throat> I take <sighs> Jiggle your bones Oh my goodness <clears throat> Let's uh, close this <gasps> Forgot to close this door. Oh my gosh, it's spooky. Ah, ah! Okay. Okay, it's just a shadow. Oh, chairs. I thought it was something else. So why are they trying to add it and subtract it? Makes no sense. Because you're still- It's their number. It's their age. That's nothing to do with you. Oh, it doesn't work. Let's put it back. Maybe, maybe I'll keep it just in case. <clears throat> for the, um... Uh... For the grandparents' room. <laughs> um, this is your... <laughs> what a mess. The entrance key should be somewhere. Should be somewhere? Dude, are you... Oh, no, 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 no. Let's keep that open. Um... I got it! Close that. I w I'm not ready! What's this? Take it. There are meds everywhere. Yes. I... Okay. Oh. 
One capsule per wig. I'm pretty sure they took more than that because they are everywhere. You're not consuming more than one. In case of intense headaches, call your doctor right away. Why would he keep all this? Grandma died a long time ago. I don't know. I don't know why he would keep all this stuff, dude. This is your grandpa. My eyes are all over the place. Grandma's diary. Let's read it. <clears throat> I don't know which one to read. Uh. Right. March 22nd, 1972. They say that having a diary is good for the brain. Well, we'll see how this goes for me then. I hate those noises. March 29th, 1972. Today we met, oh, today we went to a garage so near the center. I found a book of very good recipes. Johnny came back happy with the book too. He was very excited about it. It was a good day indeed. Mm-hmm. April 1st, 1972. I woke up in the middle of the night again. I swear there was someone staring at me in the corner of the room. 19 April 3rd, 1972. Today I found all my jewelry scattered all around the room and my wedding ring inside the kitchen sink. I asked Johnny what he was doing. I asked Johnny what he was looking for, but he swears he didn't touch a thing. April 5th, 1972, we had to bring Johnny to our bed once again. The book we bought him only causes him nightmares. We have to admit that it is a little scary though. Okay, what book was it? Okay, oh, I feel like something's, I'm, I don't know. My hands are getting sweaty and I'm uh, on the lookout. <laughs> I can't even look out beyond what I'm reading. April 9th, 1972. All my jewelry's out of place again. I cannot find my wedding ring. It was the cutest gift Albert ever gave me, but today Johnny wasn't at home. Sometimes I feel as if there was someone else in the house watching every step I make. Albert tells me not to worry. He might think I'm starting to go crazy. April 10th, 1972. What a relief! I found the ring in John's room. Honestly, I don't know what to think. <sighs> April 11th, 1972. I didn't get any sleep last night. I could not get that stupid tell of the eyeless monster out of my head. I don't know why we bought him that shitty book. May 7th, 1972. I haven't written for a long time. These weeks, I've been from a doctor to another. Something is wrong with my eyes. They don't know what is happening to them. My sight is getting blurrier each day, and it hurts a lot. May 22nd, 1972. You'd be quiet back there. God, doctors says that I've lost more than 40% of my sight in these last weeks. I find it hard to read, write, watch TV, even think of other things. My pupils are kind of e erasing from my eyes. Oh, so that's her in the pictures then. <sighs> Why am I getting tired all of a sudden? Again, every time I play this game. May 23rd, 1972. I'm tired of medication. Nothing seems to help. I cannot stand the pain anymore. Why is this happening to me? It's extremely hard for me to move around the house with my eyes like this. May 28th, 1972. I cannot stand the pain anymore. God help me, please. June 2nd, 1972. I'm really scared. I know there's something in the house, but nobody believes me. I know it's true. Even though I cannot see it, I feel the presence. There's someone living among us. Wait, wait, wait. So if she can barely read and write. When is the last day? Is she going to not be able to write? Here we go. 
So she has nice handwriting. And then it starts to become a little bit not good. Uh, May 7th is when her handwriting starts to become a little bit weird. And then May 22nd starts to get a little bit not so well. Okay. <clears throat> okay. June 3rd, 1972. I know there's someone in the house. I heard noises all night long. I swear I heard someone breathing while trying to get a glass of water. June 26, 1972. I lost more than 80% of my sight. Doctors say they no longer see any solution. I don't want to be alone in the house anymore. I'm not safe here. <clears throat> Is that the last page? Oh, here we go. <clears throat> June 27, 1972. My ring is out of place again, but it doesn't matter. Nobody will be able to find it now. I just... Hit it underneath... What? Hit it underneath the floorboard, okay. <clears throat> Maybe that's what you did with it. Can I take this? I cannot. So this is her... <clears throat> <clears throat> Why is it all over the place, though? There's nothing there. <clears throat> Let me check these uh, drawers. <clears throat> More meds? Okay. Goodness! So many medication. Check this. What's this? She, she was so sick. June 26, 1972. Elizabeth Maxwell. Ocular death exam. Cataracts diagnosis. Strange type of cataracts. Both eyeballs are turning completely white. The patient loses her sight progressively in short periods of time. Ocular damage percentage, right eye 95%, left eye 87%. We cannot define neither assure what is happening with the patient's eyes. Please continue with the medication as up to date while we find a proper treatment. Next visit July 26, 1972. <clears throat> it's locked. What are these things? You don't know what these are? You put them in the light and then you uh, you can see through the through the picture. It's just like these uh, old fashioned things. It's like, I don't know. It's, it's hard to describe. It's like a camera and it looks like this. And every time you click on it, it turns around in circles. And it has these types of things. <clears throat> Okay, now I feel like something's right behind me, but I don't know what it is. I don't want to look. I'll just pretend I'm doing something. Woohoo! Okay, I hear music. What, is that music or is that outside? No, it's not. It's, it's completely quiet where I'm at. Did you hear that? I swear I heard it. It was like over here. I don't know. I could be gone. Cr I could be going crazy. Big picture. What 
am I looking at? I can't really tell. Uranus, Neptune. What am I? Okay. Guess we gotta find the others, huh? Alright, so what am I supposed to do? So that's what she used to look like with her eyeballs. Okay. Oh. You hear it? And I thought I was going crazy, huh? No. <laughs> okay. Where's the... It's gone. Satchu's gone. Oh, what? It's open now. There's definitely someone here. It's a trick! But I really want to pick it up! What is that? I see a shadow right here. I pick it up and I bolt. No! <laughs> come on, come on, come on. Where is it? We're gonna listen to it. Possessed by a wicked entity is signified by a loss of control over the body, mind, and the soul. However, that is often not enough for the entity. It hungers for more. Things get much worse for the host. In these cases, possession is just the first step of the demon's plan. It is said there are those that return to our world seeking to resolve unfinished matters from their mortal lives. Unfinished Victims matters? of these wicked possessions are subjected to a departure of sorts. An astral transportation, for lack of a better word. An astral what? These malicious beings force their hosts to, to live moments that shouldn't be possible 
in a different place and time. Perhaps even in a different dimension altogether. It's madness. It's unclear whether these transportations occur inside the mind, or if the host is physically taken to some alternative reality. Alternative reality? I'm losing my mind. I need to hear that again. He keeps talking. I don't like it when people over talk one, one another because then I won't be able to hear. Oh, can you play it again? Becoming possessed by a wicked entity is signified by a loss of control over the body, mind, and the soul. However, that is often not enough for the entity. It hungers for more. Things get much worse for the host. In these cases, possession is just the first step of the demon's plan. It is said there are those that return to our world seeking to resolve unfinished matters from their mortal lives. The victims of these wicked possessions are subjected to a departure of sorts. An astral transportation, for lack of a better word. These malicious beings force their hosts to, to live moments that shouldn't be possible in a different place and time, perhaps even in a different dimension altogether. It's madness. It's unclear whether these transportations occur inside the mind or if the host is physically taken to some alternative reality. Okay. Hmm. Can I have my tape? No, that's mine! My tape. Uh, let's put the hammer away. Nah, maybe not. Let's, uh, we'll keep what we have. I do notice that it is a bit smoky in here. That thing is still there. La -da -da! We're not going over there! The music is uh, building up. Let's just run to the statue. I saw the thing right here. Oh, fucking shit! It's like a chess piece from Harry Potter crap. Oh my goodness. Do not switch. Uh, do not switch. Do not switch. Uh, <laughs> Set up a. Right when I felt comfortable to leave. I don't want the statue to move like, like a chess piece. And then swap out with the monster. <laughs> Slowly as we go. Oh, you son of a bitch! I don't know which way to look. We'll look in the middle. I don't want to go down this hall. It's dark. <laughs> 
I mean, it's still light, but it's dark. I don't wanna, I don't, I don't like dark spots. I mean, I did go through it right there. I guess it's fine. It like yells at you when you get close. And this is this house is like a maze, huh? Dad's room. <laughs> ah, fucking shit! Ah, no! <laughs> Fuck! I didn't see anything, but I don't like that. I don't like that. <laughs> I'm sure there was something that popped out over there. Is that statue there before? Yeah, it was there. I think maybe. The hell is that? That piano is blocking the front door. <sighs> I did not know that I could reach it from all the way over here. I don't know how far I can reach this door. Hmm. Okay, so I didn't know that. Did that change just now when we went around the corner? Throw something! Throw something, throw something. No, I can't throw anything in this game anyways. Hello? Somebody. That fucking statue. What? Am I... Am I going insane? I didn't even know it moved, dude. I was a... It was right there. Oh shit. Oh hell no. I'll make it seem like I close it all the way. What's happening here? Touch it. Touch it. Touch it. Where's this? There we go. See? These are the stuff. But that statue's in the way, so I can't really see. Can we- is it possible if we can turn it? Turn it around. What? What? What is that? What is that? Hello, hello, hello! Oh my goodness. I might as well just look at the pictures. We're looking at the pictures. I don't know what the hell that is. Grandma. Can we come down here? Why did we come down here? Why would you, uh... Sit down here, though? Then that means all the dust and people's... Dirt will come over here onto the couch and you just have to keep cleaning it.
these photos are pretty old. Yes, still old. What are we looking at in these pictures? My goodness. <laughs> I can't run. I can't run. It won't let me. He's just taking a sweet, slow, slow, sweet time. Stop that. It's just a game. It's just a game. Just just look around. It's just a game. <laughs> I wanna, I wanna go up, but at the same time, I, I'm just too scared. <sighs> She's gonna do it. Up. Be quiet. This doesn't belong to anything. How do I? What do you want? An offering? Is that what you want? You want some sort of offering? Grandpa's don't you? office. We're gonna close Grandpa's office. I don't understand why you got two different safes. If you need the combination, you know where to find it. Okay. And the clock. Can I have this? No. Ten o'clock, right? No. I don't know. I remember my combination from middle school. Uh, we had to like buy, we didn't have like lockers. Like, uh, you know, the lockers that you see in the mainland. <clears throat> but uh, for PE, for physical education, uh, we would need like a combination lock. And then I remember it, you know, like a combination lock that you get from the store. Mine was uh, three, 28, uh, I think 31 or 30. Say so the 31 or 30. 
Yeah, it's like 3, 28, 31. Maybe it might be 31. Or 30. 30, 30. And middle school was like super... It was 7th grade. 33 years old, Pasquale Maxwell. Is that your dad, I'm guessing? How Not you. To contact the dead. What the hell? All this time, we thought he went mad. But he only wanted to talk to her again. Yeah, but you got. You brought something else that wasn't her. I'm gonna take this. Because I need it for upstairs in the attic. Joseph Abraham Lake Store. I read rune cards, tarot cards, and connect to the past loved ones in the spirit world. Direction, clarification, guidance, and outcome. VIA, tarot, and runes, contact, blah, blah, blah. Liar! That is a lot of numbers. That's not even American numbers. Yeah, that's, that's too many numbers. Nothing in here, right? No. Nope. I've never done any of the tarot card readings. I don't think I ever will. It's not... I don't know, I just... I don't know. I don't want to offend anybody, but I just don't want to see what a card has to say about me. Okay, so this has to be with the... Wait, uh, do I have anything? Mm -mm. Sheesh. What the hell is that? A photo of the instructions for the silver lock. A photo of the dead person is required for accomplishing the contact. One, light up some candles in the room. Two, turn off every light. Three, use your own blood as a gift to the beyond. Your blood drop must be on the right side of the locket. Four, close your eyes and say his or her name three times. Five, oh, yeah, five, repeat until your loved one answers. <laughs> Two, one, four, six, five, eight. Isn't that the one that's over here? Oh, five, six. Oh no, it's different. Can we contact the dead? <clears throat> I don't know why you would want to contact her when she already said to you guys, like, uh, uh, about what was happening. You guys didn't believe her. I read her journal or her diary or whatever it's called. Son of a... See when the light comes on and off. Okay, I should stay on right now. Maybe. I feel like something's gonna be right over here. Oh my goodness. We're gonna get this done. Uh, 
I think I'm gonna stop it uh, here. Well, not here in this specific specific area. Specific, specific, specific. My heart is, uh, it's just racing because nothing happened and I'm sure there will be something happening pretty soon. Oh, but hopefully you guys have made a day, night, morning, evening, afternoon. Uh, please keep smiling, especially to the person who I enjoy talking to. And hopefully you guys enjoyed the stream slash video and I will see you guys late later. Bye bye.